So we are a family of six that have moved to New Zealand and we've lived here for a total of four years. We moved here initially, we lived here for two years, we moved back to the States for two years, and now we're back. So it's quite an interesting story. I'm always asked, what brought you here? Why, why did you come here? Why did you choose New Zealand over anywhere else? So I thought I'd share with you a little bit of detail about our journey. So back in 2011 and 12, we were thinking about taking a year, pulling the kids out of school, traveling around the U.S. in a camper van, and then we decided, yeah, we've kind of seen most of the U.S. So then we started thinking international, and we were only going to commit like two years, so we were thinking it had to be English speaking, and so we love everything I read about New Zealand was unbelievable and could not find any negative comment about this country. <laughs> and so we ended up applying and it took about a year and we ended up getting in. We got our visa approved and my husband got a job offer like in the same couple days and we had to move quickly. And so we came here and we came here really so we wanted our kids to have an international experience. And so we came here, we loved it here. Like we just didn't really expect to love it, I think as much as we did, um, <clears throat> you know, because you grow up in America, you're told this is the greatest place on earth. Why would you ever want to go anywhere else? And it is a great place. I'm not saying that it's not, but you just don't have it in your mind that you would really love another place. And so um, it's just stunning here. It's so beautiful everywhere you go. Um, the culture, the people are so nice. I just love how everything is done, like I just how things are run and the work-life balance is really amazing. And um, it really enables you to do a lot of things that I wasn't able to do in the States because you're just busier, because there's just different expectations and the pace just moves a lot quicker. Um, and so, yeah, so we didn't expect to love it here, but when our two years was up, we needed to go back. It had been two years since we had been home. We went back to the States, um, no intention of coming back. Then through this uh, look and see Wellington program. My husband, ran, <laughs> we kind of jokingly applied for this. Um, they're, they're bringing a hundred people from all over the world here to Wellington to check it out for, it was for IT jobs specifically, and they're flying them here for free and doing some interviewing. And it was like thousands of people like applied. It, there was like a 0.0100% I don't know, small percentage to come here. And he ended up getting it, getting um, companies interested in them. And so we came and long story short, we were like, we are not moving again. And anyway, so we're back. And so we've been here for two years. Uh, we live, we still live in Wellington because, you know, when we were here the first two years, we spent a lot of time traveling most of the country and just still loved Wellington. And, you know, that's where he ended up getting a job anyway. And so... Uh, we love it here. Our kids love it here. Um, there's just, you know, I really can't say enough good things about it. Um, and so that's kind of our story. So it's kind of unique because we like moved here, we moved back, and then we moved back. So if any of you are thinking about traveling international, please comment, reach out to me because I got all these skills now that I'd like to share or would like to be helpful <laughs> to tell you what to bring, not to bring. I know how to do it, everyone. So let me know, I'd be happy to help. Um, so yeah, and happy to answer any questions or talk about anything, but that's just a little bit about our story. Everybody's wondering why you're here, why did you pick New Zealand? Um, why do you like Wellington, that sort of thing. And so that's our story. Mm -hmm.